Hi, greetings from Japan. My name is Daniel Guys. I am the Senior Marketing Officer for the International College of Liberal Arts here in Kofu, Yamanashi. We are a liberal arts college offering a Bachelor of International Liberal Arts with majors in Global Business and Economics, Political Science, Interdisciplinary Art and Japan Studies. Uh, our course is taught entirely in English. You do not need to speak any Japanese to apply or to enroll. You might not have realized that uh, you could study in Japan uh, in English, um, but there are some very good reasons why you should consider Japan as your study destination. Um, the economy is very highly regulated in Japan and education is no different. Um, we are accredited by the Ministry of Education and this degree is recognized internationally. It's a very high quality degree that you'll be getting. It's also very affordable. Compared to other locations like uh, America, the UK, Australia, for example, uh, Japanese international students um, pay the same fees as domestic students. So you're paying the same uh, low fees that they are, uh, not a multiple of what a domestic student would be paying. Japan is also a very safe country, um, politically uh, stable, um, and the crime rate is very low. Crimes against foreigners are almost unheard of. Uh, Japan has a bit of a uh, demographic issue, uh, which is that its population is shrinking rather rapidly. It's aging and people are not having uh, that many children anymore. This is leading the Japanese economy to internationalize rapidly. Uh, this is leading to great employment opportunities for graduates of Japanese universities. Um, but most importantly, Japan is an amazing place to live and to study uh, the way that they uh, balance the built and the natural environment, the ancient and the modern, uh, continues to uh, fascinate and delight everyone that uh, comes here. The people are fantastic, they're very welcoming, uh, the food is magic, um, and you've got these great access to you know, some of the, the great mega cities of the world, um, but also um, very peaceful and ancient spots as well that you can visit and experience the culture on a very deep level. ICLA is located about 90 minutes outside of Tokyo uh, by rail, about two hours by bus. Uh, so you've got great access to Tokyo, uh, but a more relaxed and uh, sort of semi-rural environment. Um, we are located in Yamanashi Prefecture. It is renowned as the home of Mount Fuji. We have about three quarters of the mountain uh, within our borders. Um, so some of the great, you know, sort of scenes of Mount Fuji that you've seen over the years uh, were no doubt taken, um, you know, from nearby our campus. Um, you know, we have the Five Lakes of Fuji area, uh, which is about 40 minutes drive from here. Um, it's a very popular spot with people for camping, fishing, hiking, mountain climbing, um, all kinds of outdoor activities. Uh, many people own holiday homes in the area as well. Um, we have the full four seasons here, from the cherry blossoms in spring uh, through to a you know, hot, dry for Japan summer, and then a beautiful autumn as well. Um, and you know, a cold winter, but it's not too bad, don't worry. We're also renowned as a uh, fruit and uh, wine producing region. We have many uh, vineyards and orchards here as well. This contributes to our lower cost of living than uh, one of the larger cities in Japan like Tokyo, Osaka, etc. Uh, Yamanashi uh, Gakuin University uh, is the university that ICLA is a department of. Um, it's a private, not-for-profit university that was founded after the Second World War. It's quite famous in Japan for the number of Olympians that it's produced uh, over the years. Um, it has about 4,000 students. Um, ICLA has about 220 enrolled currently. Uh, we are taught in English. Obviously, the other faculties are taught in Japanese. Uh, we also have a postgraduate school of social sciences taught in Japanese as well. ICLA is one of the newer departments of YGU. We were founded in 2015. We offer one bachelor uh, program, that is the Bachelor of International Liberal Arts. We have about 60% of our students uh, coming from overseas, uh, the rest from Japan. 
um, our students come from all corners of the globe, uh, from over 40 different nationalities. Um, and we have a great student to faculty ratio. So uh, it's a five to one student to faculty ratio. So you get great access to the teaching staff here um, and a lot of collaboration goes on. And again, I must stress, it is taught entirely in English. You do not need to know any Japanese uh, to apply or to enrol at ICLA. Um, our curriculum, we have four majors. Uh, as a liberal arts college, you will declare your major at the end of your first year. You can choose uh, from four. Uh, we have majors in global business and economics, political science, interdisciplinary art, and Japan studies. Within each of those majors, there are pathways leading to a variety of careers. Um, we also have many electives and workshops. One of the features of a liberal arts uh, curriculum is that you are encouraged to take electives from outside of your major. Um, we have electives in uh, subjects broad as data science, uh, psychology and sociology, uh, quantitative reasoning, natural sciences and many in Japanese martial arts as well. So you can try your hand at you know, karate, aikido, judo, uh, etc. Um, these electives really strengthen your major um, and allow you to pursue interests um, that you may have. We're in Japan, so naturally, um, you know, we can teach you Japanese while you're here. So we have a Japanese language program as well that can take you from absolute beginner all the way up to advanced uh, with support uh, for you to take the, the Japanese language proficiency tests, level uh, N2 and N1, the highest levels uh, respectively, um, and you can start anywhere along that journey. We also have a study abroad program. Uh, many of our students go overseas in their third year on mutual tuition waiver, and we have um, over uh, 70 partners in over 30 different countries. Um, our workshops are something that uh, are quite unique to ICLA, we're very proud of them. Um, there are other universities teaching degrees in English in Japan, uh, they will teach you Japanese, uh, but we do have a particular focus on teaching you about Japanese culture as well. So through our uh, workshops you can uh, try your hand at many different uh, Japanese art forms uh, and experience the culture on a deep level. Um, those art forms so as broad as uh, flower arranging, ikebana, the tea ceremony, uh, calligraphy. Um, as I said, the tea ceremony, uh, you can learn about samurai culture. Here are some of our students participating in the uh, Shingenko Matsuri. They made this armor themselves, actually. You can learn a Japanese musical instrument like the koto or the shakuhachi, uh, and so on. Uh, our campus is a very open, light, environmentally friendly buildings, a lot of glass, uh, and we have accommodation on site. Uh, it's actually mandatory for all first year students to live in our dorms. Uh, you get your own room, uh, you're just sharing bath and toilet uh, facilities. And if you are very lucky, uh, this may be the view uh, of Fuji that you have from outside of your dorm window. Um, we have over 90 different clubs here at uh, YGU um, and ICLA students uh, can participate in the full uh, range of them. We also have a variety of uh, festivals uh, and parties and sporting events throughout the year. Um, there are many uh, sporting clubs you can try out for as well if you'd like to compete at an elite level, um, but there's also a lot of casual events uh, going on as well. Our fees uh, are about uh, 14,500 USD per year um, and then you have the housing fee and the uh, meal plan on top of that. We actually uh, have a cafeteria on site and uh, we can serve you three meals uh, per, uh, on weekdays uh, during semester. We also have uh, scholarships available uh, for all students to apply for. We have four tiers of the scholarship from 25% up to a full 100% waiver of your tuition uh, facility and equipment fees. Applying for this is very easy. You just need to uh, submit an extra essay with your application. 
Uh, speaking of which, uh, our applications are done uh, completely online. Uh, we have two admissions periods uh, per year. Uh, we have intakes in April and September each year. Uh, you can see the uh, deadlines for both of those uh, on screen. Um, to apply, uh, you will need to provide your documents, a statement of purpose, uh, two references as well. Uh, you will also have an interview with two members of the faculty. Thank you for your attention uh, during this presentation. Uh, for more information, please don't hesitate to email us, uh, follow us on social media through Facebook, Instagram, uh, check out our YouTube channel uh, for you know, campus tours and uh, videos of many of our workshops uh, and the like. Uh, thank you very much.